Right, I always said I'd keep away from record pours, spice spinning them. So I guess what I'm going to do, yes. This could go one of two ways. Either could go wrong or it could go disastrously, disaster, I can't even say it, disastrously wrong. It's one or the other. It's all good fun. I hope. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to spin it too fast because I don't want to get covered in it basically. Got way too much paint in there, but what the heck? Yeah, I'm not going to spin it too fast. I'll do that some other time. Uh, I'll give it a bit of a stir. Oops, there you go, it's going everywhere. Looks like it's covered everywhere. I did put a little silicone in this as well, in each paint. As you can see, there's lots of cells. I have still more paint left over. I'll do it, I'll give this a little torch. I really need to throw this torch away and get a new one. There's a few cells coming up this way. Nice cells going through the pink. The pinky purple.
trust looks like he's given up the cost altogether now. Oh. Yeah, I think a new small torch, a new chef's torch is on the agenda. This is the one where I used to do use for cooking or for doing my chefy bits. So might just get a new one I think. I'm quite liking that. Lots of cells in this one. So as I said I'd always said I'd never do this again, I tried it once and I failed miserably when I first started. But I think it's safe to say I'm quite happy with that one. Make a nice clock. Anyone who wants to buy it, give me a shout. <laughs> it's yours. Alright, I'll take some photos. Let me know what you think. Come on.